guys, welcome back to my channel. It's me, lovely Nika. So today I'll be sharing with you guys my updated brow routine. Now this is a routine that I've been using for the last year and I absolutely love it. So it's been updated and so today I'm going to show you guys how I create these natural looking brows using a few items. And if you guys want to see how I do it, please stick around and keep on watching. So I'm starting out with my favorite brow pens in the entire world, which is Anastasia Beverly Hills Brow Wiz. The shade is called Brunette, which is a really nice natural deep brow, which is great for outlining or filling in your brows if you want that natural look. So I'm using this brow pencil to outline the shape of my brows as well as elongate the look as well. I do like a more of an elongated brow because my brow stops really, really short. <laughs> And I find that a more elongated brow just looks really, really nice on my face shape. So I'm using this pencil in short strokes and basically outlining the shape of my brows. And I'm going to do this on the top and I'm going to do this on the bottom. And I'm going to go ahead and show you guys what I do next. So after I finish outlining my brows, I'm going to use this eyebrow powder from Wet n Wild Cosmetics and I'm going to apply it with my Sedona Lace Eyeshadow Brush number EB17 and I'm going to start off with the lightest color of that kit and I'm going to use this color to fill in the inner part of my brow. Now by using a lighter shade, it's going to give me more of a gradient brow effect. So I'm lightly filling it in and just will go ahead and work that product into uh, my arch as well. So it's very important that you pick up a little bit of product at a time instead of using a lot so this way you can build on the color and get more of a natural look so next I'm taking a darker shade I'm gonna go ahead and focus this in the arch of my brows really really using light short strokes and work the product in from my arch extend it outward to the tail of my brows now I love this eyebrow powder it just looks super super natural and it's not too dark, it's not black, it's not too brown. It just looks like your own real brow hairs. And I absolutely love this from Wet n Wild. It has become my favorite and I'm just loving it. So I'm just go ahead and gently brush the product out a little bit with my brush. Next, I'm using this MAC 195 Synthetic Brush and my MAC Pro Longwear Foundation in NC45. Now, I'm going to go and use these products to clean up the shape of my brow. And I'm going to take a little bit of product on the back of my hand, work that product into my brush. I'm going to go ahead and clean up the shape and give me more of that fresh, done brow look. And I absolutely love to use my foundation versus concealer and I've been using this for a long time and it just makes my brows look even more natural.
clean up my brows I use my finger to remove any excess foundation around the areas of my brows and then this is what the end product will look like after I finish applying my foundation and everything so I hope you guys enjoy this tutorial and I will see you guys in my next video stay tuned for this upcoming makeup tutorial and I thank you guys so much for watching a list of everything will be down in the bottom bar don't forget thumbs up if you want more videos and I see you guys again